Pixel sorting, pixel sorting, pixel sorting. Yeah, you've probably heard about this technique. As with a lot of things in Touch Designer, there are probably a dozen ways you can do it, but yeah, here is the easiest one that I can think of. You'll need one image, one feedback top, one noise, the size of your image, one composite, and one display stop. Connect them like this, drag the displays onto the feedback. Yeah, we should probably throw in a keyboard and chop so that we could preset our feedback loop by pressing 1. Now, go to displays. Set the displays weight to something really small like that. Nice. Turn off the interpolation. Now go to noise, set it to random and do the app standout seconds here. And yeah, like, that's it. And now you're like, cool. And I'm like, cool. And you're like, but can you do that with the video? And I'm like, totally. Let me show you. Load a video into the movie file in. Now it's just sorting the first frame, which is not what we want. Insert a crossfade here. Connect our movie file into the second input. Nothing is happening. Go to crossfade and set it to be something really small. You can also go for a webcam as an input source. Look, I'm, I'm melting. So yeah, here is a basic pixel sorting setup. Try to fit it different images, try to modify the feedback loop. Play with it, you know, have fun. I hope you liked this little tutorial. If you have a topic that you want me to break down, write it in the comments, as well as any other questions that you have. See you in the next one.